often do you make pizza at home? If the answer is not very often because you don't have the tools or you think you don't have the tools that you need to make it, think again. Today I'm making the deep dish pie plate pizza with prosciutto, broccoli, and cheddar, but you could fill it with anything. And once you see this technique, you're gonna be using it all the time. Start off with about 12 ounces of dough in a pie plate with about a tablespoon of olive oil and just press the dough into the bottom and up the sides of the plate. If it starts getting a little bit springy, you could just set it aside for a few minutes, let it rest, and then it'll get a little bit easier to work with. I have about an ounce of soppressata. You can use pepperoni if you like or any kind of delicious salty pork product will do. You need about an ounce. These were big, so I'm cutting them in quarters. Mix that together with about one and a quarter cups of broccoli florets. What's your favorite pizza topping? I'm telling you what mine is. It's soppressata, tomato, a little bit of garlic, and mozzarella cheese. But this one is a close rival in deliciousness. I just added a pinch of hot pepper flakes and a little bit of oil and season with a little bit of salt and pepper. Dough hasn't been sitting for quite five minutes, but let's see what happened. It's already relaxed quite a bit. You really do want to get this as much up the sides as you can. Once you add your filling, you can press it up the sides even more, so don't kill yourself to get it done. You were thinking like, well, I wasn't going to do that. I wasn't going to kill myself. Why would I do that? <laughs> add about a quarter cup of shredded cheddar cheese. I always go for the extra sharp, but whatever you like. Then all of your toppings, spread it evenly out. You can use this opportunity to move pizza up the sides a little bit more. Sprinkle with the remaining quarter cup of cheese. So it's a half a cup total per pizza. And then about a tablespoon of grated Parmesan, give or take. One more little stretch. And then just pop this into a 450 degree oven and you wanna bake it until it's puffed and cooked through and the cheese is melted. That should take about 14, 15, 16 minutes, something like that. How fun is that? Pie plate pizza, it's fantastic. I'm just gonna loosen it a little bit with my knife. Get it out of here. <laughs> Ta-da, comes right out. Cut it into pieces, eat it up. If you feel like this is missing a little sauce, throw a little sauce on there. I don't care. I'm not gonna tell anybody. You are gonna love it. It's healthy, right? It has broccoli on it. <laughs> Come on guys, make this pizza, you're really, really gonna love it.